Lloyd uh, really emphasized that with you about that first inning yesterday. Here's a, uh, and uh, Policelli had no idea where the ball went, but he finally picks it off. A wild pitch to move the runner to second, so there goes your double play possibility on a ground ball. I think the challenge right now is can you keep them off the board, keep this team from scoring in the first inning? Because it happens a lot. You know, we discussed this last night, Jim, about the first inning woes for the Mudheads. I think it's worth mentioning again here. Now the 1-0 is right there. One ball, one strike on Castro with Jack Swinski batting only 190, but a grand slam last night. I think you can actually group in the second inning too, Jim, because it's the early part of the game. But the Mudheads have been outscored 59-46 to in the first, and they've been outscored 53-41 to in the second. A lot of games you're falling behind early in. And a, a hard shot foul. That kind of surprised me. I thought the gap would be more than 13. I mean, that's enough, but I'm surprised we've scored 46 in the first inning. Well, and the other part of that, too, is, Jim, the Mud Hens are 21 and 31 when the opponent scores first. So 10 mm -hmm. games under 500. They give up that first run of the game. At second base, Marcano. Castro waits for the one two. Manning checks him out there twice. Here it comes, and a slow curve is fouled away. That was a good pitch. But he managed to spoil it, and it's still one and two on Rodolfo. 11 home runs on the air and 36 driven in. A beautiful late July evening here in downtown Toledo. 27th already. Pitch in, he got him swinging, strike three, and that's a big strikeout. Two down, it brings up Jack Sowinski, who hit the grand slam in the first inning last night. Hey, nothing like striking out the top ice cream yeah, player. Get, get the tops guy, and uh, there are some lucky folks now about to get some top ice cream. Well, don't forget, uh, that's a Forest View strikeout, Jim, for strikes, spikes, pub, and grub. Stop by Forest View Lanes in Bedford. Michigan. Can I bring that up because there is a Bedford, Ohio, right? Right. There is, yeah. Wow, the Reds out to a hot start. Bottom of the first inning, they lead 4 nothing over Miami. Hmm. Strike one on Sawinski. And Manning deals, and the hard slider right there, it's strike two. Two down and Marcano at second base. Now Matt has only served up 17 pitches so far, not too bad. Here it comes and this one is high and wide. It's one and two. He's trying to get Jack to go fishing. But he didn't bite. And the one two is due up. Lyme address the next batter, top of the first. The Indians have a man in second with two down. Matt takes his time. He's getting the sign from Policelli. And the one-two is swung on and missed. He got him. Matt Manning with a good start. Even though he gave up a leadoff single, he gets the next three. And this time, the Indians will not score. In the first inning, they picked up a hit and leave a man. We go on to the bottom of the first.